Hello and welcome back to Fallout 76. Today we are going to be spending some legendary modules and once again, this will be Crusader Pistols. This is our second attempt. The first video we did, we did 25 Crusader Pistols and it was pretty much all trash. So once again, I have crafted 25 Crusader Pistols. So we are going to be spending 100 legendary modules and hopefully this round goes better than the first round. I do feel like I'm a bit of a slow learner. The game is telling me don't do this anymore and yet I keep doing it. So here we go, first one. Assassins, uh, faster fire rate, 90% reduced weight. Uh, faster fire rate really isn't all that useful on this weapon. You could pull the trigger. I mean, you can fire basically as fast as you can pull the trigger. Doesn't have an automatic receiver, so uh, reduced weight. It's a pistol, you don't need that. And Assassins is only pretty much good for PvP, which I don't do. All right, after that slow start, we got the bad one out of the way. So let's go on to the next one. We have Berserkers, 50% uh, chance to hit a target in Vats, plus one perception. That's actually an okay roll if you are playing Berserkers. This character is not. So on we go. And we have the next one. Juggernauts replenish AP with each kill. Weapon breaks slower. Juggernauts mid-tier effect. Not my favorite just because it tends to... Uh, it's affected when you when you start taking damage, you do less damage. I'm not a fan of that. Replenish AP with each kill. That's, a, that's an okay effect. Weapon breaks slower. Not really an issue. Overall, this is script. Here we go. Mutant Slayers, 50% uh, chance to hit a target of VATS, damage resistance while reloading. I don't care for enemy specific uh, prefixes. VATS hit chance is okay, damage resist while reloading is fairly useless. I mean, at this point, I'd love to just get one Crusader pistol that has reduced AP cost. I have never rolled a Crusader pistol with reduced AP cost, so maybe this will be the one. No. Uh, another Mutant Slayers, VATS hit chance. That's critical charge, so the second and third star are good, but the first one is not. And for the next one, we have Assassins again. Ooh, okay. Uh, Vat, uh, limb damage and Vat's critical charge. Eh, assassins, limb damage, don't care for that. Vat's critical charge is okay, but overall, this is a dud. I think we're going to do better on this one, though. I have a really good feeling about it. Aristocrats. I like Aristocrats. Replenish AP with each kill. That's actually okay. Uh, plus one agility. Eh, a little, uh, you know, a little bit of extra... Sneakiness, a little bit extra AP. Uh, this one overall is probably the best one I've rolled so far. And the next one we have is Gourmands with bullets explode and faster reload speed. Uh, reload speed isn't really an issue in this gun. It reloads fairly quickly. Uh, I do want to run it with the laser mod and exploding bullets don't work with that. So overall this would be... Yeah, if it wasn't exploding bullets, if that second star was something else, this would actually be useful. But because I want to run the laser or the uh, fusion receiver, uh, exploding bullets is a no-go. Next one is Aristocrats again. Uh, weapon speed, movement speed while aiming. Uh, the other Aristocrats was better. Weapon speed just I don't think is all, yet, all that useful on this gun just because you can fire as fast as you can pull the trigger. Movement speed while aiming I think is pretty useless. So overall, I'd say this is script. For the next one, we have... Executioners, which is okay. Damage while aiming, I tend to use it in VAT, so that's not all that useful. And reload speed, not super useful either. So this is basically a one star, at least for my purposes. Uh, the Aristocrats I rolled, the first one is better. The next one is Berserkers, damage while aiming, VAT's critical charge. Yeah, and then again, you have an, a non-VAT's effect and a VAT's effect. So those two don't work well together, so this would definitely be script. And still, nothing with reduced AP cost. That that doesn't seem to be an effect I could roll on weapons lately. So we've got Zealots, which is worthless. Last round, which is worthless. And Break Slower, which is worthless. So yeah, a lot of trash. Okay, well, I know it can't be worse than the one we just got. It can be just as bad, but it won't be worse, which is good. Juggernauts again. Uh, Vats hit chance, plus one perception. Juggernauts is only so-so in my book. Uh, Vats hit chance is fine. Perception is fine. But this is not this is not what I'm looking for, so this is going to be script. And we have junkies. Bullets explode. Weapon breaks slower. Explodes. I've already talked about that. Uh, junkies. My character doesn't have any addiction, so junkies is useless. Weapon breaks useless. So overall, this is script. All right, let's waste some more modules. Stalkers. Yep, that's that's a waste for sure. Stalkers replenish AP with each kill. Vats critical charge. Yep, this is trash. And the next one we have. Assassins, Ugh, that's no good. Last round, no good. Reduced weight, pointless. Yeah, this is just a whole lot of nothing. I'm honestly starting to feel like I should just give up on Crusader pistols, but on we go. 
Vampires, bullets explode, chance to generate a stealth field. This is actually an okay tagging weapon. If you're in something like Rad Rumble, something like that. Uh, vampires exploding, I mean, good for tagging, good for keeping your health up. So overall, it's good. It's just not what I'm looking for. And the next one will be Aristocrats. Faster fire rate, damage resist while reloading. I already got a better Aristocrats than this one. And on we go. I mean, I do like that Aristocrats is coming up. It's just the other effects that are coming are just not what I'm looking for. Uh, no critical, no extra critical damage so far and no uh, reduced AP cost. So uh, that would be nice if we could get, uh, if we get that to change, that'd be great. Exterminators, Vats hit chance again, chance to generate a stealth field. So Exterminator sucks and this weapon sucks. And let's see about this one. Assassins again with exploding bullets and reload speed. Actually, this is probably an okay PvP weapon if you wanted to uh, have a pistol duel, but I don't, so on we go. We are already down to the final five, and this has been, uh, yeah, very frustrating. But let's, uh, <laughs> let's go on. Mutant Slayers, bullets explode, faster reload speed. Wow, exploding bullets has come up a lot, and so has reload speed. Not really looking for any of these effects, though. And this is, I think, number four, with four to go. Berserker's last round, damage resist while aiming. Uh, that's actually horrible. I mean, if you're a Berserker, you don't want damage resist while you're trying to shoot your weapon because that'll that'll reduce the damage. So this is, this is a pretty crappy Berserker's uh, weapon. Okay, three to go. Juggernauts again, last round. Vat's critical charge. Uh, uh, moving on. And then there were two. Mutants. Mutants isn't the worst, it's a mid-tier effect. Bash damage isn't great, critical charge is okay, but overall, scrip. All right, this is the last one, the last chance to uh, redeem this whole uh, this whole endeavor. And we have Junkies with bash damage and weapon break slower. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay, so out of all of the ones I rolled, this is really the only one that, that kind of works for what I'm looking for. It's, it's by no means a god roll, it's an okay roll, what I would call, uh, just kind of so-so. Uh, and it's actually better than the one I'm currently using, so which is pretty sad. But my luck with Crusader pistols has just been terrible. Uh, so anyway, the hunt goes on, but the uh, <laughs> this is where we landed. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit one of the buttons down below. And I hope you'll join me in the next one. Thank you very much.